Hi guys, so this is my ninth video and it's watermelon design. I call it watermelon. My mom just calls it strawberry, so you can either call it watermelon or strawberry. I think, see, let me get close to the camera so you can see my little lighter green line. Eight. So this it won uses EC Pink uh, Bachelor Batch Bash Bash. It's hard to say. Uh, Black Mark Jordana Thin Brush. Green with Envy Sally Hansen. Invisible Sally Hansen. And nail art. Club green it doesn't have a name. It's just green. Anyways, all right. So what you start off with doing is you do two or three coats of the pink. Two or three coats of this pink. And then you take your green. This is pretty similar to Frenching your nails. I feel um, I do the same process except with French you go over it again with the pink. This you don't because you would cover the green. And you just kind of drag it along the tip. Now, since this isn't a see-through color, you don't have to cover your full tip. I go straight across, just like a watermelon would be. Oh, I just stripped on my computer. Hold on one second. I need to get that off. Hey, ASAP. Because I don't want green nail polish on my computer. Okay. Sorry about that. Alright, so you drag it across and you do two coats of that. You do the one and this is going to drip again and I'm going to make it bigger. Um, you do the one and then you just go over it. This one can be a little bit thicker because it just really makes the green pop and not so drag marky. Um, like that and then sometimes I come in here and I go this way a little bit just to get a more even line alright next step is to take your black and do some polka dots really really simple I like to do thick polka dots, but you can do thick polka dots, thin polka dots. I like thick because they look more like seeds than the thin ones. But personal preference here. See? And then I'll throw a few thin ones in there just because you have some small seeds too. Can't be biased against the small seeds. And the last step is you take your green. Which I know you can't really see it, but it is there and it is a pop and it does draw people's eyes. And you just drag it along and do stripes. I don't know if you can see this on the computer. But see, I can do it again on this one. You just drag it along and do tiny stripes only on the green. And it looks more like a rhyme. Can you see it? Okay, so just one more time through all the steps. It's green. You do the base coat. You take the green. You do two coats over the tip, just dragging it. And again, with the second coat, feel free to go this way a little bit. Just double check you like it. You then take your black and you polka dot or plant seeds. Now, another thing with your polka dots is I don't like to do, see how that's just like straight row? I like to scatter them a little bit. Because otherwise they will look not as realistic. 
you know, that one just got a lot of thin dots, is which is exactly what I told you I didn't like, but that's okay. And then you take your green, which again, this is the part I don't think you can see very well because I can hardly see it on my nails, but I know it's there. And you line, and again, line. Okay, so that was my ninth video. This is my ninth week doing it, which means I'm a little over two months. Look at that shenanigan. And then you just put clear coat over it, and it looks amazing. You get compliments. It's fun. Hope you enjoyed. Watch next week. Bye.